Guys, my dad just said, Carrie, we've had it. We are kicking you out. What? My mom said, get out of here and never come back. I'm just gonna ask, why are you kicking me out? Dad said, you're so useless and dumb and we don't want you anymore. Oh, and he just said something with a ton of hashtags. Why are they being so mean to me right now? Where am I supposed to go? I mean, y'all are my parents. My mom just said, we never want to see you again. Whoa, whoa, okay, 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 guys. They are literally pushing me off of their property. Okay, I'm just gonna say, fine, I'll... I'll go! Gosh, you guys, I cannot believe that my parents just kicked me out! Guys, and my mom just blocked me! Are you kidding me? No, I really have nowhere to go, and I have got to figure something out. What the? This is my new life now, I guess, and it's starting off terribly. Oh, gosh. Well, you guys, a few weeks have passed, and my life hasn't gotten any better. I am so still homeless and all my clothes are ruined and I've just been living near this dumpster and I don't even have any food and I am starving. Maybe I can find someone around here to give me some cash to first to get like a little something. Oh, oh, somebody's parking over here and it looks like a really nice car. Oh yeah, guys, this guy looks super well off. His name is literally CEO Steven. Okay, I'm gonna see if he'll spare some change. I'm just gonna say, um, hi, sir. Uh, he just said, what do you want? Uh, I'm gonna say, um, I, I'm, I'm really hungry and have nowhere to go. He said, no, get away from me, you disgusting piece of filth. What? Uh, please. I, I, he said, how dare you speak to me? I should have you arrested for talking to you. Okay, you cannot arrest me for talking to you. And he's just walking away from me now. Are, are you kidding me, you guys? Right now, I have no idea how the heck I'm going to survive. But I'm, I'm not giving up, okay? I have got to figure things out somehow. You guys, a few years have passed and my life is so much different now. I finally have my very first job and I have been slowly starting to save up to finally rent my own apartment. Things are finally starting to look up for me. Oh gosh. Chloe said, oh, look over there, Jen. It's that girl, ha. And Jenny said, it's the homeless girl. Let's go say hi. Oh, good, good. I can't wait and I can't even be mean because I work here. LOL, I can't believe they still let her work here. She stinks, ew. No, I don't. I, okay, I still have places to shower, you know. Hey there, freak. Okay, I'm fine. I'm just gonna customer service. Here we go. I'm just gonna say, uh, hi. Uh, what can I help you with? I know they don't want to order anything. You must be really dumb. That's why you're never at school. I'm just gonna say, actually, I just uh, I work a lot and study on my own time, okay? I still read and have books and stuff. Ha, good one, Jen. Really? I didn't think it was that good, but you know, do y'all want anything? Oh, we want something. Okay, maybe at least this time they will order something and give me a chance to go in the back and make some food and get out from in front of them. We want you to stop being such a freak. What? Okay, that's, that's just mean, okay? Y'all don't have to bully me. Go do something else. Like, don't y'all have anything better to do? Go take a shower, loser. Uh, I, I I can't handle this. I'm gonna say, y'all need to get out. Okay, you know what? I, I know I've had a hard life, but one day I'm gonna be so rich that y'all can never talk to me again. Yeah, right. That would be absolutely impossible for a homeless freak like you. Uh, seriously, what the heck? Let's go shopping. I, th that's all they came in here for? They're not going to get a soda or anything? They don't even know how hard I've worked to get this far. Okay, and if I keep working hard, then I'm sure life is going to get better and I'll just show them. Guys, I am literally getting fired from my job right now. What the heck? My boss, Evan, said that's it. You're fired. Uh, the level of incompetence you have is unbelievable. I'm going to say, please let me, let me explain. You guys, today has been awful. I came into work this morning like normal and there was a crazy Karen that came in and started making a huge scene. Evan said, what is it? What could you have to say? Uh, it's the Karen's fault. Okay. Um, she ordered a burger and got mad when there was meat on it. I, that, that's literally what a burger is. How was I supposed
supposed to know she didn't eat meat? Evan said, and if she reports it to corporate, I will get my bonus, so you have to go? Wait, seriously? Guys, if I lose my job right now, I won't be able to pay rent. I just got a new place, and I've been saving up all year for it. Uh, please, I need this paycheck. I don't know how else I'm gonna get a job. Do I look like I care? Are you kidding me? Get lost? And, and guys, he's, he's literally leaving. Wait, Mr. Evans. Oh my gosh. What is up with these people? They're awful. Uh, this girl in this alleyway just popped out and said, Psst, hey, you in the pink sweater. I'm just gonna reply and say, uh, me? Yes, you. Come over here. Oh, uh, okay. You guys, I don't know who this girl is. Maybe I know her or something? I don't know. I guess I'll see what she wants. Oh, why, why is she in this alleyway? She looks really creepy. She's looking all black. It looks kind of shady. What's up? I don't really have anything to lose now, I guess. She said, hey, kid, you in need of some money? Um, guys, she must have overheard my conversation with uh, Mr. Evans. I'm just going to say yes. That I saw you get fired. I know you need some. Oh, guys, I'm getting bad vibes here. I'm getting bad vibes from this girl. Listen, kid, I can give you a chance to make a ton of money real fast. Wait, what? Really? Lots of money really fast always seems sketch, you guys. She said, then you'll become super rich. Something about this seems suspicious. I'm just gonna say, I don't know. You'd never need to work at Bloxy Burgers again. Well, I mean, I can't work there anyways, considering I just got fired. Besides, you don't have any other options. She's not totally wrong, you guys. I cannot lose the apartment that I worked so hard for. Fine. Okay, I'm just gonna say, I I'm, I'm in. I don't know what I'm signing up for, but if it helps me pay rent, then I'm gonna do it. Great. Follow me, kid. Okay, guys, what did I just get myself into? Okay, guys, Tara just took me to this super ginormous fancy house, but um, I have no idea what we're doing here. Uh, there's no way that Tara lives here. I mean, she does not look like somebody who would own a house this big. Tara said, listen up, kiddo. There's a very rich man that lives at this house. Oh, uh, oh, she's whispering too. I'm just gonna whisper back and be like, okay. And we are gonna rob him. Wait, huh? Wait, no, what? I, I didn't sign up for that, guys. I didn't want to be a criminal. This guy has so much money, he won't even notice if some of his stuff is missing. What? Seriously, this, this was the plan the whole time? I guess that explains the get rich fast. She said it's the quickest way to make some serious bank. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Don't worry, kid. You won't be robbing anything. Wait. And all you're gonna do is be knocking on his door, meeting him, and distracting him. Okay? Guys, I don't know about this. I mean, I guess it's not as bad since I'm not actually the one stealing, but I cannot believe I'm about to be involved in something illegal, but I still have no choice. Otherwise, I'll be broke and homeless forever. Guys, like I said, I'm just gonna do this one time so I can pay my rent and then I will get a regular job again. But, but, but before we do that, I have to let you guys know about this huge warehouse sale at Hyper Apparel. Everything on the website is 50% off. Go check it out at hyperapparel.shop. Link is in the description box below. And I will never do anything illegal ever again. All right, here we go. I'm knocking on the door. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, I see someone coming. Guys, that's him. Frederick Riches. And oh, okay, you guys. He definitely looks very rich. He said, hello. What brings you to my door at this hour? Um, guys, I, I didn't even think of a distraction. I'm just gonna say, uh, I, um, I'm selling Girl Scout cookies. Oh, what flavors do you have? I love cookies. Wait, th that's actually working? I, uh, I don't actually have any cookies, but I'm going with it. I'm just gonna say I have all the flavors. Uh, chocolate chip, uh, Thin Mints. Mmm, Thin Mints. Oh gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Uh, what am I gonna do if he has to buy some? I'm gonna say, uh, well, uh, he said I'll take two cases. Okay, guys, I, I need to try to get him out of the house. I'm gonna say, oh, well, they're, uh, right out here. Uh, follow me. Guys, I don't know where I'm leading him. I'm just trying to get him out of the front door. I'm gonna try and just walk over here. Oh my gosh, here he comes, here he comes. He said, I love helping the youth. Guys, this guy seems really nice. Oh, man. I can't do this. I, I, I. I can't do this. I can't do this. Uh, sir, you're being robbed right now. Okay, uh, we need to go inside fast. He just said what? Okay, okay, go, go, go. I, I, I promise I'll explain everything. Once we
we get there, maybe Tara won't even have taken anything. We can just leave and it'll all be one big misunderstanding. Oh no, oh no. Guys, I'm guessing this is where the safe is. <gasps> oh gosh, he just said no, my safe. Guys, it's been totally ransacked. And where is Tara? Where, where, where the heck did she go? Did she just run off and leave me? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. You, did you have something to do with this? I'm gonna say, well, I, um, actually, uh, I, I was just, uh, supposed to, uh, distract you. Um, I was gonna be homeless, and I, he said, what? How dare you? Oh no, guys, guys, my explanation does not sound good. Oh, this is so bad. He said, you're going to jail for a very long time. Oh my gosh, you guys. I guess I deserve this. Okay, guys, it's been a few weeks since I've been in jail. I have just been sitting in this cell, but at least I'm finally starting to kind of get used to it. I just wish I had never joined hands with that stupid, tricky Tara. Oh, here's Officer Goody. Oh my gosh. He said, you have a visitor. Wait, I do? Guys, I don't know anybody to have any visitors. He just said, come with me. I, it's not like I've got any family or anything. What the? Frederick Riches? What, what is he doing here? He just said, hello, uh, how are you doing? Uh, well, I'm in jail, so, uh, the best I can, I guess. Listen, I've decided to drop the charges against you so you'll be released from prison. Wait, what? What? Why? Why would he do that? Especially after what I tried to do. I, I let him get robbed. Thank you so much. Okay, um, and I, I promise to never do anything illegal ever again, okay? I swear, guys, I have more than learned my lesson. Well, actually, you can get involved in something illegal one last time. I need your help. Wait, you're the only person who knows what the thief looks like. You're the only one who can catch her. Wait, that's what this is about? He wants to catch Tara? You got it. All right, you guys, I am getting out of jail. I have been looking around for Tara literally everywhere, but honestly, you guys, she could have fled this city by now. I have literally no clue where she is, and I have no idea how I'm supposed to help Mr. Riches get her arrested. I Hold on, you guys. I I, I think those are Tara's clothes. It she, looks like she just got a new hairstyle. Oh, oh my God. Oh, my gosh. I'm just going to say, OMG, Tara. Oh, she turned around. Yes, guys, this is her. What? I mean, that was a pretty nice coincidence. She just said, what the? Kiddo, nice to see ya. She said, I thought you were in prison. Glad to see you made it out. Wait, guys, she's seeming pretty nice to me right now, so she must not know that I ratted her out. I uh, convinced uh, the guy to let me go, that it, it was uh, just a coincidence that I was there um, and had nothing to do with the robbery. I'm not gonna lie, you guys, I'm, I'm kind of shocked that she's like talking to me so openly right now, but I can't share any of the money we stole because, well, I spent it all, what, huh? How is that even possible? I mean, she must have stolen millions of dollars. Well, um, I actually found a way to make twice the money as we did last time. But I need your help. She just said, whoa, really? Guys, she seems interested. That sounds like a fun time, kiddo. You're acting more like a criminal. I like it. Okay, you guys, she's fell for it. That means go time. All right, we're here to rob this mega mansion guys this house is way bigger than mr rich's it's filled with more money than we could ever imagine okay guys i'm trying to get tara super hyped up right now this is huge kiddo i can't believe you found this place yeah it was it was pretty cool of me since you're the mastermind this time how do we get inside okay i'm gonna say well i saw the owner hide the spare key so we can just walk in the front door. You guys, I have already got the keys right here. Okay, great. Sneak inside. There we go. There we go. Hey, Tara, over here. Rich people always hide stuff behind bookcases. All right, here we go, you guys. Here we go. And we'll just open up this secret door. Holy cow, that is a lot of cash. 
trash. Insane fine, kiddo. We should work together more often now that you're a pro. I'm just gonna keep playing along. I'm gonna say, ha ha, yeah. Got everything you want? She said, yeah, kid, we're gonna be rich. Officer Goody! What? Officer? What? Officer Goody said, we saw everything on the security cameras. You snitched? I'm gonna say, uh, yes, I did. Officer Goody said, and you're under arrest. She said, I can't believe this. I mean, she did ditch me the last time. She said, I just tried to make you rich. I'm gonna say, well, I don't wanna be rich that way, okay? I wanna be rich the whole fashion way by working hard. All right, you guys, I am back at Mr. Rich's house. Tara is officially in jail and Mr. Rich's got all of his money back. He said, Carrie, you did a great job catching that vile thief. Thank you so much for everything. Uh, I mean, it, literally catching that girl was the least I could do. I promise I'll never do anything illegal ever again. Uh, and one day I'm going to work so hard that I can be as rich as you in a legal way. He said, ha ha, that day might just come sooner than you think. Wait, uh, I don't really understand how. I mean, it took me forever to just get my own apartment. I cannot imagine being rich enough to have a house like this. He said, well, I've been looking into your life, okay? He said, I know how hard things have been for you. And despite that, you were able to overcome those hardships. I'm just gonna say, well, yeah, but it'll still take a ton of work to get this far. He said, now I want to help you. What? How? I mean, guys, he literally helped me get out of jail. How else can he help me? He said, you see, I've lived a long life. I mean, yeah, but he's not that old, you guys. He doesn't even have gray hair yet. He said, the one thing I've been searching for is a good person to inherit what I've built. And I've decided that person is you, Carrie. Wait, what? Uh, me? But uh, there is no way I deserve that. I mean, I literally almost, I helped this guy get robbed in the first place. He wouldn't have even had this problem if it wasn't for me. He said, that's right. Listen, I don't really care about the money that thief stole. I'm a trillionaire. That small amount doesn't matter much. Wait, huh? He said, what I care about is the honesty you showed, your ability to solve problems, and that's why I'm going to adopt you. What? Adopt me? What the heck, guys? I did not see this coming. What? Holy cow! That's right, I want to adopt you! I'm just gonna say, oh, oh gee, uh, okay! I mean, guys, who am I to say no? He said, but first, you're gonna need a new outfit! Whoa, whoa, ho, ho, holy cow, you guys! I look so rich now! Uh, does this mean I'm a, uh, trillionaire, too? He said, rich looks good on you. I mean, I, yeah, I think so too. <laughs> what the heck? <gasps> he said, this is what happens when you're a good person. I, 